What's up guys this is Ronnie welcome back to our channel Total Technology this is tutorial 36 and today's topic will be how to draw shapes using uh, graphics sub package or package so in the earlier version it was uh, kind of a sub package but in the latest version as per the documentation it is fully integrated with the report lab library so you can call it as a, as a package within report lab so we have seen how to create uh, different shapes using canvas uh, but here we'll be going to use this uh, graphics package so this is very simple tutorial but but this is again another of another way of creating uh, different graphics or shapes okay so how to generate different shapes using uh, graphics so there is not much talking yes we can directly uh, move on to our id so let me open a clip so what i'll do is like from report lab dot graphics import let's say shapes yes and probably i think in uh, shapes and drawing we need two uh, main feature or main uh, class with one is shape and one is uh, drawing no i think one is okay yes one is rendered pf sorry okay so now next thing uh, let's say we'll create one uh, drawing underscore obj equals to shapes dot drawing and we'll define our width and height so let's say our width will be 500 or height will be 200 okay and then drawing underscore obj dot uh, add this not coming why this is add or in capital not coming strange some problem in my id probably let's right add okay so this is coming so this will be going to be this shapes again if shapes dot uh, okay shapes dot sorry so now the thing is that uh, we have we have created let me explain these things we have created one drawing object over here okay and it is actually defining this boundary like width and height now we are going to add shapes so uh, drawing dr okay so that is why it is not coming i just did a spelling mistake here okay so shapes and now we, we are going to write like what we are actually going to do so probably we can uh, do some rectangle yes rectangle so this is going to be 10 10 then probably width is 250 and height let's say 100 and we'll give some sort of feel color equals to okay we need to import another library here from report lab dot leave import colors so this is going to be let's see is color so this is going to be colors dot blue okay so now we'll render the shape inside a PDF. So this is going to be render PDF dot draw to file, right? So we'll give the object name, okay? Drawing object, then we'll give a name to this file. Let's say tutorial tu tutorial 36 this is dot pdf and we'll define one message and this is going to be let's say tutorial 36 okay so this is done so if we run this thing there will be one file with this name oh, this tutorial 36 so let's run this thing okay So let me refresh this thing now so this is created see this is this is a nice looking rectangle okay so now we can do something else as well so what I'll do uh, 
let's uh, change this thing mm. how to generate okay how to generate shapes so this is to generate sh a sh p e rectangle probably can give rectangle here okay so now next thing is circle so definitely we can easily achieve this thing rectangle as well so what do we need to do we just uh, circle and for this thing x center y center and the radius so probably radius will be let's say 50 so let's run this thing now terminated so let's refresh again so it is here actually so what you have to do you have to just move it a bit uh, this side so what i'll do i'll just keep it a bit upwards um, or probably 50 and here also it is 50 and let's run this thing well see this is nice looking okay so what i'll do i'll just again put this thing over here so this is simple thing but again this is very unique uh, if you are having some sort of other requirement or if you want to use if you don't know if you if you didn't if you didn't like create your pdf file using canvas method you are just using uh, doc template or platypus for creating your uh, pdf file in that case you will be not be uh, able to use canvas for creating drawing uh, creating drawings ob or drawing object or creating shapes so in that case uh, you definitely need to use this graphics uh, package so that is why this is going to be very unique and important so that's it there are several other things you can do if you want to know more about this thing i'll highly recommend you guys to go through the uh, report lab official documentation there are multiple other things that are available but the ultimate uh, fundamental uh, code will be always same like this you can tweak this thing you can let's say if i tell you something let me open so the requirement is that you 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 you, you, sh you want to have multiple objects so that is also possible so probably i can do it in the next tutorial but as i told you the ultimate thing is this thing like you need to import this library you have to create your canvas sorry not canvas the file size you have to set this thing and after that you need to do this thing that's it this is very simple so i hope you guys uh, enjoying this tutorial and the whole series i would like to know uh, kind of a feedback from all of you guys all all of my students from udemy as well from uh, youtube and if you're having any suggestion complaint or any feedback or if you want to uh, like if you want me to include some other use case or co cover some other use case or whether you are doing on or working on some sort of project where you want to use report lab and you are facing some difficulties you can directly write me i will try to incorporate all those use cases in our next tutorial so that's all guys and hope to see in the next video till then take care goodbye and don't forget to subscribe our channel and hit the bell icon so that you should not miss any notification all the udemy students please 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 uh, uh, try to uh, complete all the courses and if you are having any doubt please reach me out via udemy community chat box or directly you can send me pms i will always available and will try to answer all your queries so that's it guys that's all for today hope to see in the next video till then take care goodbye and have a nice day